Aloha from Hawaii. So I wanted to show you how to use the tan mousse. And when you buy this from me, initially you need to get the, the mitt set along with the, the mousse itself. And then these are reusable. And so you can wash them and then it's really the only time you have to buy them. Normally I would do this without anything on, but I'm gonna show you how to do just some bigger sections. Okay, so there's three pieces. There's this little soft mitt, there's the big soft mitt, and then the exfoliating mitt. So all you need to do is just take a minute and just wipe down everything and just do an exfoliant. You could even probably use this in the shower if you wanted to, but I'm just gonna go ahead and do it here and just do a dry exfoliant just to get off the last layers of skin. Okay, so use the exfoliant mitt for that. Then you're gonna take your soft mitt and you're gonna do one side of the body first because then you're going to want to switch hands and take it to the other side. So just a few tips before I get started. One is I start on the big areas first. So you're gonna see me working on the legs first and that, that'll always get fresh pumps. So any big areas of the body, the arms, the legs, fresh pumps. I wait until the mousse is pretty well rubbed in in the big area and there's not a, a pile of mousse left. And then I go to the sensitive areas that seem to hold tan a little bit more like your feet, your knees, your elbows, and then the face and the neck. So I don't add mousse to put onto my face. I use the residual. And then I'll also do the tops of the hands, which I'll do last. So let's just go ahead and get started. Okay, this is one, two. All right, so I'm gonna start, let me actually start on my legs. I think that would be the best place to start. Normally, when I'm fully nude and doing this on myself, I start on the top and work my way down. So I'm gonna start on the bottom and work my way up. So let me go ahead and go here. I wanna show you how you can actually see the mousse going in. So can you see the color there? So you can actually see your lines, you know where you've gotten it. I avoid the knees. I do not do the knees. And then rub it in. Okay, we gotta get that back side. I always do two pumps. Back side. I'm excited to show the before and the after. I did get a little bit of a sunburn walking around. I'm kind of bummed about that. I was really good and I just missed that strip of sunscreen. All right, now we're gonna work our way down to the legs the bottom of the legs here. So down the shin, watch that ankle, watch that knee. Just be really good. You can see where the tan's going, so just kind of be mindful of that. And just like a spray tan, you're gonna wanna shower, shave, do all of that in the morning, do that nice scrub after. But this is so light and it smells so good, almost like a fruity tropical smell. It reminds me of like juicy fruit. So now I don't have any left and I'm gonna go ahead and hit the bottoms of my feet. So just here on the bottoms, tops of the toes. Okay, so you can see let me drop this down just a smidgen. Sorry guys, you're getting kind of a posh posh here. Maybe in the future I'll make a slightly better video. But, so there's leg number one, leg number two. I might just keep the video here. This is a little bit better. Okay, so I'm gonna do just kind of a double check. Oop, I can tell that I missed. I'm gonna have to switch hands on that because I can't quite, I always miss that spot and have to, change my hands out. So I can tell I missed this spot right here. So I am gonna go right in. 
and I'm really excited because we have family pictures tomorrow and just look at the difference in the legs. Okay, so I might actually go ahead and pause for just a second. All right, thank you, Cora. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and do the other side. So two pumps, so now you can kind of see me a little bit better right there. Hi! I'm putting on my tanning mousse and making a video. Oh. What's up? I was going to see. Want me to pause my video real quick? No, I'll come I'll talk to you. Okay. <laughs> hey, I'm your kid. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so there you can see, and I just want you to notice how easy it is to tell where you've missed a line right there, right? Like you can see where I've rubbed in. So that's how you track where you need to put more mousse. And you literally just rub it in to your body. It is like the best thing ever. I love it more than any like over-the-counter lotion or anything like that. Super pretty. Okay, so you're just gonna work all over your body like that. Super easy to follow. You wanna protect your hands. Make sure you don't get it on your hands. And just see where. Okay, now I'm gonna go over my knees just a little bit here. And then I'm gonna go over my feet and around my ankles because I don't have any more on. Okay, and then the way the mousse works, you have to leave it on for a minimum of four hours. And that four hours, you will get a nice, I call natural tan. And then if you wanna leave it on a little bit longer, up to eight hours, you're gonna get a darker tan. Same rules apply, okay? So you're not going to get into any water, right? You're not going to sweat. Look at it, natural glow. So I'm gonna see, I'm gonna use you as my mirror. Sorry guys. And I do have, just because of the nature of tanning in a swimsuit, that's why I don't use, if you're gonna do this, do it naked. Because then you can make sure you get all the spots. It's hard to see if you're getting all the spots there. Okay. So there are my legs. I love it. Natural tan. And then here we go on the arm. So it's gonna be, sorry guys, I've gotta take a strap off here because otherwise it's gonna drive me crazy. So just same thing, I'm gonna rub in. So you can come up to the top, rub in. Really easy to see where your lines are, what you're missing. And this is quick and easy, right? Super quick and easy. It's right into the skin. Now, again, you're gonna wanna avoid the elbows and the tops of the hands until you've rubbed the mousse into the bigger areas. Okay, so there is a comparison of the tops of the arms and that will continue to darken. So you can kind of see what's been tanned and what hasn't. So if you have any more questions about how to use the mousse, let me know. I'm happy to help you with it. Um, appreciate your patience with my, my, rough, my rough cut video of being on vacation with my entire extended family. Um, but I hope you enjoy your product. I love it. This is my favorite thing to take on vacation because as my tan fades in the water, which it does, I love being spray tan, but the minute I went and played in the ocean today and my tan went away. But on vacation, I take this with me and then I can just keep it up. So it smells great, easy to apply. You really can't screw it up. And um, I think the tan is beautiful and natural. So let me know if I can help you with any more product.